You're back. The champions have been dealt with. You should be dead. You seem disappointed. The gods are punishing me. I'm a mercenary. Killing is what I do. There's nothing godly about it. Modest, but mortal. And Hades will have you too. We'll cross that river when we get to it. I don't have time for this. Sparta must take this region now, while we have the chance. Let's get this over with. I couldn't agree more. The sooner I'm rid of you, the better.
victory is ours! If I hadn't been here, you'd never have survived. My father would have ensured a more decisive victory. But he's not here. Oh, we have you to thank for that, if I recall. Uh, don't start. Don't you dare tell me what to do. I am in command here. You needed my help. By the gods, how are you so arrogant? No wonder my father discarded you. You know nothing about my family. I know he threw you off of a cliff and chose me instead. Oh, now who's being arrogant? You were an afterthought. You were second place. We'll see about that. What do you mean? Now that we've driven the Athenians from the field, it's time I dealt with my true enemy. Stentor, Your you... Your job is done, mercenary. Now I will kill you for what you stole from me in Megaris. Why are you doing this? Because... Because you marched into Megaris, ruined the fucking war, and murdered my father! I did what I had to! And so will I! What could you possibly gain from killing me? Justice, vengeance, peace! One would be enough, but all three is better! You think vengeance will dull your pain? Trust me, it won't. Here's the thing. I don't trust you. You don't have to do this, Stentor. Oh, but I do. There is nothing you can say to convince me otherwise. This isn't what Nikolaus would have wanted. Oh, you fucking know. Traitor. I am not a traitor. You betrayed Sparta. You betrayed your family. You killed my father and stole my chance at a normal life. You deserve nothing but the cold of my blade buried in your heart. Killing each other will not heal the wounds of the past. Pater! Hello, Centaur. I thought you were dead. Not just yet. She should pay for what she's done. Times do I have to tell you? Stentor, she owes me nothing. I don't understand. You both have a greater role to play. Become the leader I trained you to be. Lead the armies of Sparta and be victorious. How? You are an honorable man, a loyal son, and a great warrior. You will be a better commander than I ever was. You can do this. I will, father. I will make you proud. You already have. That could have ended badly. Cassandra, a shadow grows across Sparta. Be cautious when you return. Mother and I will deal with it. You found her? Ruling Naxos. Sounds like her. May the gods watch over you both. Suffering. There may still be hope if I can learn more about what ails you. It's no longer about me. I'm worried for my son. A boy still needs his father around. Besides, Dikios is a smart boy. He'll be fine. Not if my rivals have their way.
Hippocrates. You know it's unwise to upset a patient. He asks me to end his life when he knows I can't. Messius, please help me. I'm in such terrible pain. You cannot simply ask someone to kill you in my presence. I'm your physician. I will not allow it. I can ease your pain, analyze your symptoms, and try to cure you. But that's all. Life is about choice, and we should all be able to choose for ourselves when we leave this world. And I will, once I know my family's future is secured. Secured how? My family is one of the richest in Thebes, and we have many rivals. When I die, my son will become the head of our house. Oh. Ah, he's just a boy. Ah. Uh, I need to ensure they can't take advantage of my death. I'll deal with your rivals, and give your son a fighting chance. Thank you, Mistyus. If you steal their assets, it will weaken their position and prevent them from posing a threat to my family. That will buy my son time. What do I need to steal? To really weaken them? Steal their debt registry, their mortgage testimonials, and their collection of fine jewels. Where do I need to go? Their estate is nearby. It's one of the most finely decorated homes in all of Thebes. Except for mine, of course. Why not just kill them and remove the threat for good? If they're weakened, they won't pose a threat to my family's position. If they're removed, another family will rise up to take their place and still pose a threat. This solution keeps my family safe and their position secure. Stealing isn't normally what I'm paid for, but I'll get it done. If doing this helps bring him some semblance of peace, I will pray for Tiki to watch over you. Everything worth taking. Mm. 
Definitely heard something over there. You earn your freedom. Join my crew and sail with us. I've done what you asked. Your family's position will be secure for quite some time. You have given me hope that my name will live on long after I'm gone. All I can ask the gods for now is that my son lives a longer and happier life than I. I'm in your debt. You don't owe me a thing, really. Now, it pains me to ask. But I need your help with one more thing. I know what you want to ask. This disease will claim me. Be it today or another in the future. It's a matter of when, not if. Hippocrates won't just let me kill you. No, but he listened to you. If you can convince him it's what's best for me, he might change his mind. I don't want to slowly waste away. I want to die in peace while my family remembers me in a good light. Hippocrates is stubborn, but for good reason. He believes in helping people, not hurting them. I don't think I'll convince him otherwise. I know he means well, but he must know I'm beyond saving. Still, I understand your choice. Now, I think I need to rest. If you have a moment, I would ask you to help me with something. He seems to be resting peacefully now. Yes, you helped ease his mind, but he'll never truly be at peace until he takes his last breath. When will that be? It's hard to tell. Judging by his symptoms, it'll be sooner rather than later. I can lessen his pain, but to do so, I'll need some hemlock. I'll collect the ingredients you need. Thank you. It won't stop the pain entirely, but I hope it'll help him feel more comfortable. He doesn't want to feel better. He wants to die with some dignity. True dignity would be fighting through this, so I can analyze his symptoms further. He wants to die, and he's in pain. You should respect his right to choose instead of treating him like an experiment. What you're doing is wrong. I will not be lectured on the morality of my work by a sellsword. I have a responsibility, like all healers, to use my knowledge for the betterment of others. Hemlock is rare. Where do you harvest it? It grows all across Viotia, but check near the tumulus of Platea. I'm sure I saw some when I was last there. Why are you treating him with poison? Hemlock is deadly. Only in the wrong dosage. If my observations are correct, it should lessen the pain racking his body. 
I'll get the hemlock you need. That's what I'm looking for. I got the hemlock you wanted. Thank you. I know this task was a little beneath you, but it will help my friend here. I've prepared the elixir base, but I need you to grind the herb and add it to the mixture. I think I can handle that. Be mindful of the amount you add. While the hemlock is an excellent pain inhibitor, too much can be lethal. Just as the doctor ordered. He seems to be calmer now. The potion is working. With what I learn here, I, I could help many more who still have a chance at life. Good luck, Hippocrates. I hope our paths cross again in the future. Forgive me, Mistios. There are many who still need my help. of appearing the moment I need you. What a power I may wield. Is there ever a time you don't need me? Good point. The drunk politician you had me take home? We ran into a bit of trouble. That's terrible. I'm glad to see you're okay. Yes. Thankfully, we both made it out alive. Oh, I see. <laughs> Thank you for telling me. You seem disappointed. I'm just uh, impressed you were able to save the both of you. You said you needed something? Ah, to business already. Fine. It's simple, really. There's an item that holds great sentimental value I'd like you to retrieve. What do I need to find? It's an Olisvos. If you saw it on the ground, even you wouldn't bend over to pick it up. But it means so much to me. To hold it again would mean more than you know. I never took you for someone who cared for sentimental things. I'm so much more than my beautiful face and flowing blonde locks. Like what? Well, let's see. People forget I'm an orphan, that Pericles isn't my father. I know what it's like to lose family, too. Ah, <sighs> we have that in common. There's more to you than I thought, Miss Theos. Now, where were we? You're a big boy. Get it yourself. I sure am. But there's a small chance the woman who has it won't exactly be happy to see me again. There has to be a story behind this thing. When you see the Olisvos, you'll know. When you have it in your hands, against your skin, when you feel the weight of it, you'll know. Every time we talk, it seems like you're about to sleep with someone, or want to, or you've just finished. Is this woman the most recent one? Who said I slept with her? It was a safe guess. How do you find time for anything else? Determination, mostly. There's a closeness you can only feel with someone in those moments. Who wouldn't crave that? I'll get the Olisbos for you. There's a small chance the woman may wish to keep it for herself, uh, to spite me. It may be best to go unseen and hurry back. She lives east of here. Don't worry. You'll have it in your hands soon. It's made out of stone. I guess that could work. Ah, that's it in your hand. You brought it. Hmm, it's different than I remember it looking. And much bigger, too. 
She's going to miss it. This was never yours, was it? You had me steal it. We didn't just steal an Olisphos. We stole a family heirloom and a husband's confidence. Without it, he'll be focused on his wife instead of his business. I think she'll enjoy the change of pace. You lied! Again! I don't think I did. I was very particular with my words. You said it was sentimental. It is, just not to me. There wasn't a single lie. That's not how it feels. The only thing that matters is you retrieved the Olisphos and helped me a great deal. What about me? Now, now, we wash each other's backs, don't we? There's a reason you never turn me down, after all. How about I show you how these Olisphos can make all the difference? You've made me curious. Let's try it out. I knew you'd be open to it. Oh, that was something. It's different, but you'll get used to it. Ah, I hope you're right. I think this is the place on this map. These would have lined the offering box. The lid of the offering box. These ribbons tied the box shut. here, but it's empty. Perhaps one of these couples saw something. I thought you would like it. It doesn't matter if I liked it. You stole from... Do you have any idea how much it was worth? What it's worth? What's a curse from the gods worth? Don't be a superstitious donkey. That bracelet was priceless. Hey! All you care about is money. What about how I feel? Hey! I wanted to impress you. You wanted to get into my clothes, you mean? Hey! Huh. What do you want? Tremble, you fools! For I am the wrath of Apollo! I told you, Laos. The gods come to punish us. Exactly. Give me what I want? But I will smite you down. And what do you want? Fool? She wants the bracelet you stole. You understand completely. Give me the bracelet. I threw it off the cliffs, into the sea. Malaka. Guess I'm going for a swim. <laughs> I said I was sorry. I am cursed by the gods. <laughs> <laughs> 